Hey folks, this is Isaac. I want to show you how to set up your secure print. We're moving towards secure print here in the Mid-Atlantic District. And as our schools come online, it's super simple. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. So before we get started, I am going to assume some things. I'm going to assume you have your printer installed. If you need help with this, please see your school ET for assistance. Otherwise, we'll move forward. All right, so I'm going, I've am i got a document I want to print here. I'm going to click print, super simple. Now this is a first time piece. I'm gonna make sure I select my proper printer. And this is important, every time you print, know where it's going, all right? So I'm going to uh, select the printer that I want it to go to. And when I click print, the first time, it's gonna run through this process here. Now the first time, it's gonna ask you to set a passcode, all right? This is the passcode we're gonna type onto the printer to retrieve the print. So we recommend you do a, at least a four digit, obviously it's a four digit to 10 digit passcode. Recommending to stay on the four digit end, it's easier to remember. So think about like the last four of your phone number, um, your birth year, uh, month and date of a birth date of somebody close to you, things like that. Your favorite numbers combined uh, make it as challenging as you need it to be. But listen, you have to remember it. You have to remember this, okay? All right, so I'm going to create my pass pin. I'm gonna type it twice. So I don't make, sh I make sure I do not make a mistake. And once I click okay, my print just went to uh, the printer that I selected. Now, what we're going to do is we're gonna to go to the printer. I'm gonna show you that side of it. Before we do that, I want you to be aware of, uh, it's 4.30 now, our print jobs are stored on those printers for 12 hours. So by 4.30 in the morning, 4.30 a.m., um, it will disappear. Okay, I've got a full 12 hours. That means if I print, get to work super early, like six o'clock in the morning, that print should be available to me until 6 p.m. at night. All right, that gives you one full work day to collect your print. Um, all right, so we're gonna pause the video here, super simple, and go to the printer. Hey, okay, so we are here at the printer. Boop. And all I'm going to do is I've just walked into the room, I've selected, I've gone to the printer that I know I sent my print to, and now I'm going to retrieve it. Here we go. So at the printer, I'm just going to power it on and I'm going to go to jobs. And automatically it brings up the secure print option. Now you'll notice that there are some other prints ready to be received or retrieved. All I have to do is I'm gonna click on my name. I'm gonna type in my passcode. We do not share passcodes. And I have my different documents. Now, because I printed using my CAC ID, you'll notice that each of my prints have a title, right? So I can either select the print, so I'm gonna select this top one, and it automatically prints for me, or I can select print all, or I can select delete all. If I want to delete one, because the top one I just printed that's coming out now is the same as this bottom one, I'm going to click delete here. And I just removed that one without wasting paper. Okay, now um, for the rest of these, I'm going to delete all because I don't need those. I am choosing to be paper responsible. Okay, and that is secure print. Once I'm done, I click home. My, I, this will log out of my system uh, within 30 seconds and we are all set to go. Remember, you have 12 hours to retrieve your print you should create a pin that is about four characters in length. Also, do not share your pin. That's a standard practice. All right, that's all you need to know for secure printing.